Welcome back to it. Oh, dead. Takes a couple seconds. Yeah. Now, give you a countdown and then it doesn't load. And then it doesn't go away. Alright. Welcome back to part two. Poetry. That's for squares and dorks. It's all about rock and roll, obviously. Um, thanks to anyone that stuck around or just showed up. I'm going to pretend you exist. But at least Joe is here. I can see him. And i um, going to play a song to start off this set that is about, or it mentions where this is hypothetically occurring right now, which is the rendezvous. Enjoy the waves for another moment before we go to the rendezvous.
Woohoo! Here's a good Friday song. This is about calling in sick on Monday, which uh, if you've got some sick days stored up, I think you should do it. I say go for it. Let your weekend go one extra day. You have my endorsement. Um, if you like the songs you're hearing, you can buy all of them on Bandcamp. This is from this album right here. Mm. Sexy. Remember compact discs? Yeah. It was all the rage back in the day, bro. Anyway, sick day. Enjoy. <laughs>
Zuckerberg and everybody else watching. This is the point where the set starts to pick up a little bit. Gonna rock out just a tiny bit more here. Dedicating the next song to anyone that has ever put their change in the wrong meter. It's easy to do around here. Wow, that one's noisy, huh? Let's try this one. Hmm. Let's try this one. Ooh, that's a noisy set. Let's go with that.
Joe's going to tell a joke while I retune, because I forgot I'm not supposed to use the tremolo ever since the new setup. It just goes, it gets whacked every time I do that. All right, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> I am good. Remember how we practiced? <laughs> wow. I really took this to another universe here. I'm going to put a sticky note that says don't use the tram until you get it set up again. Looking for a good loot here. Should have waited till the next song because I'm going to do one more on this guitar and on the switch guitars and I could really just wank. Oh well, next time. Here we go. All right. This is about the midpoint of the set. We're gonna lose our minds here. Oh no, there's two more. Yeah, that's right. We're gonna do that one and then that one. And then the others. Oh, we're gonna do three more. Yeah, I'm getting ahead of myself. Hey Facebook, anybody like the kinks? This is kind of a deep cut from the Kinks. Ray Davies, one of the great Tist, America, uh, British songwriters. And uh, this is one of my favorite Kinks songs. It's called Fancy. <laughs>
is one of the first Frost Hughes album called Frost Hughes. It's right here. Don't you want it? Compact disc, latest technology? Purchase it online it's, or buy it. Venmo me, dude, and I'll sell you one of these. I've got I've got a few left. It's called Loose Thread. Thank you. 
first half of the set. Uh, Joe's... <laughs> no, you're just going to watch me change guitars. That's what's going to happen. Joe doesn't get paid to tell my jokes or banter with the audience. Audience? What audience? It's just a screen. <laughs> Hi, Zuckerberg. How's it going? really ought to rethink your policy there, bud, about not uh, flagging that doofus's posts. You know the guy I'm talking about? The guy with the orange. Uh, all right. This is the casino part of the set. You want to meet the casino. And uh, that last song, Losing My Mind, featured... Uh, a mix of Cyborg and also live drummer Brian DePippo and human bassist James Frederick Lowe, both of whom I liked very much and miss dearly. Someday perhaps we'll play live music again, but for now I've captured their souls in this little box. Um, and here's James again on this one. This is a primarily bird-themed second half of the set. Uh, bird lovers lucked out. Let's turn this down just a tiny bit. It's called Dookie See God, which I'm sure you can tell right away is a palindrome. Same forwards as backwards. <laughs> Yeah. 
Gracias. Uh, no, don't get ahead of yourself, Hales.
That was the Kingfisher's coronation. Thank you for attending. I'm gonna play two more songs. Um, yeah. But first, some ruby red grapefruit seltzer. Mm. So refreshing. You know what? I'm gonna, gonna freshen up first. Three more. I do have a way of getting ahead of myself. This one's called Ostrich Coat, keeping with the bird theme. And uh, you will follow in the news. Recent times, you learn that the man who entitled, who gave me the title for this song, Mr. Paul Manafort, just was granted house arrest. But he was hoping everyone else in that administration ends up in jail someday soon. Kingfisher agrees.
more bird sound. <clears throat> Anybody out on Facebook know what the collective word is for a group of larks? Joe? <clears throat> An exaltation of larks. <laughs> like a murder of crows or a an unkindness of ravens. <laughs> the actual one. Um, the song is called An Exaltation of Larks. And let's make sure we have everything turned on that we want. Get that out of the way. Go away. Welcome to An Exaltation of Larks. <laughs>
barking with the dog and ringing the bell. We complete what we've come here to do tonight. Thank you to everyone that has watched, even if you just skimmed past. Uh, but especially to those of you that may have lingered. I can see that there's comments or something in the side. Is that cool? I will look at those in a moment. But thanks everybody for watching. Thanks to Joe Farina for coming to my house and doing sound so that Greenfield and Turners can like shake hands and reach across and put their divides and their division behind and become one the way they were meant to be. <laughs> okay, thank you to our friends that requested poems and to everybody that watched. Have a great night.